Hey guys, welcome back to Incredible Signs. Today we have another egg drop video. You guys wanted to see more after yesterday or two days ago's video egg drop. We had 10 egg drop designs today. I have a bunch more. So vote below. Let me know which one was your favorite. I definitely know which one was my favorite. I think it's, it was number six, the one with the three plates and like a, it's like an airplane almost coming down it. It was so cool. You'll see it. But there were a lot of other cool designs there too. The ones with the balloons look like a Mars lunar rover. I think just because I saw it the day before. So it wasn't fresh to me, but that was really cool. The one with the straws was really, really cool too. So I actually had a, a bunch of favorites. Um, if you want to comment below and let me know what you want me to do with an egg, I may just do it because I already am taking fidget spinners and gonna be making an egg drop with a fidget spinner. That is coming up, not today, but in the next coming days because we have some more cool egg drop designs and maybe I'll put a video together of like the top five egg drop designs. But today we have like 12 more. I will be building a spinner egg drop protector, whatever you wanna call it, putting that in another video in the upcoming week. Now don't forget guys, on Sunday, Thank you, first of all. We just hit 7, 7,000, 700,000 subscribers. My mind is blown, I can't believe it. Thank you for everyone that subscribed. If you have not subscribed yet, please subscribe right now. We are on the road to a million. It seems impossible, but hopefully one day we'll get there. A little way of saying thank you right now before the big giveaway, before the big exciting video on Sunday, which is tomorrow. Today I'm giving away a pop socket. All you have to do is comment below when you hear me here, when you hear me say the word anti-gravity. It's like a double word. But when you hear me say that, be the first to comment the exact time and I will send this to you. You can win three times in 60 days. So if you've already won once or twice, you could still win a third time. If you haven't won at all, don't give up because people have won more than once. So that just tells you it's not that hard. So listen up, we're gonna get right into the egg drop experiments. Now again, thank you so much for 700,000 subscribers and just subscribe if you have not yet. Now let's get into the video. And again, comment below, let me know which one is your favorite. Let's go. Anti-gravity eggs coming up. Guys, here we are, number one. So, bunch of straws around it. Really cool design. There's a sponge underneath it. It looks awesome. Question is, will it be protected when it falls to the ground just from the straws? So the sponge is there to protect it too. And the straws, and here it comes, here it comes. It looks like it hit sponge first. And it looks like it, it's in one piece. Can we reach 3,000 likes? Thumbs up, guys. Hit that like button. Opening it up, yes, there it is. The egg is intact. Number two looks just like a missile, like a little grenade. All it is, I think it was tape obviously around. Oh, it's a roll of toilet paper. Boom, and some cotton. Well, not boom now. And some cotton in it. Roll of toilet paper with some cotton on top. And you know, sometimes the simplest designs work the best. And here's proof right here that that is not the case. <laughs> it did not work. I got mixed up. I thought this one worked. That did not work. This one looked amazing. I forgot about this one earlier. This was an orange, a big orange with toothpicks closing the top because the egg is inside it. So that was a really cool way to seal it and it'll also protect it. So I totally thought this would work. Here it comes. Smash. And no, not at all. It looked so cool. I was like, hey, it's pretty soft inside, but no. Number four is a little parachute. So there's there are two parachute designs here now. One just has a cup with one bag on top that's gonna fly down. And the egg is inside it. Let's see what happens. It I slowed down the speed here, but it, it sort of slowed down a little bit. The air the bag did fill up with air. Let's see if it survived. I don't remember what happened here. And it it was padded around with a lot of tissue paper inside it. And yes, it did survive. Now this second design had a box with the egg inside it in a tissue box with three parachutes, three bags, uh, and yes. no, it did not survive. You see the one bag was better because it was able to open up with air. Too many bags there, it just got in the way. This one, a lot of balloons, it was like a Mars lunar lander, a ton of balloons with the egg protected inside. Let's chuck it out the window and see if the design holds up again. And here it comes, here it comes. It gives such a soft landing with these balloons. 
it's hard, it's like a challenge to break it when you're throwing it out with these balloons around it. It's just so protected. Yeah. Here it is. The way to get to the egg is just pop some balloons. And there it is. Now it popped a little as he was removing the tape from it. The tape just pulled it off. This was one of my favorites hands down. So there are three plates on top. The egg is in the white part on top of the, on top of the, well bottom of the bottle, but by the plate. And it sort of floated down like a parachute, like a glider, a hang glider. And look where the egg is, it's genius. It's on top of the plate. There was a hole underneath the wood that was really protected. It was on top of everything. And then the little kid, I loved it, so cool. And it survived, yes. Victory. This one was a box. And in the box, I forgot what was in the box. We'll see in a second, actually. In the box was, oh, it was couscous, like a type of food, a, a grain, I think, which was in a plastic bag, and the egg survived. So pretty surprising, actually. I didn't think the actual plastic container did crack. Here was a box, and in the box, I think, was flour. And did it survive? Did it protect the, oh, no, this was actually tissue paper. Just tissue paper in a box. Again, like I said earlier, sometimes the simplest designs work. In this case, did it work? The suspense is killing us. Yes, it did work. It did work. Just paper, tissue paper in a box. Here was flour in a box and it did not survive, probably because the egg's positioning. This was awesome. The egg was floating in the box, suspended by tape, and it survived. I missed the actual throwing of it, and here's another one. A bottle with some foam around it, some padding, some silver foil, looked high tech, looked like it would work, but as we see right here, didn't look too promising, guys. Comment below, let me know which one was your favorite, and we'll see you soon. Oh, one more. There was, oh, fo styrofoam, a styrofoam container. In the styrofoam container was a red, a red Play-Doh, and around the Play-Doh was super glue egg, super hot glue egg. All right, guys, I thought that was super cool. Again, let me know which one your favorite was. Mine was either the straws or the one with the plates that just floated down. Again, the balloons were cool. The, the little box was cool. The floating one with the silver tape, I forgot about that one. That was amazing, actually. It was like suspended in midair. So those were, those were all cool. So now I'm gonna start doing this for a future video coming up this week. I'm trying to figure out the best way to do this. If you guys have any ideas or suggestions how I can use spinners to make a good, like a protective, protective, uh, cage for it, I guess. Maybe I should like glue it to the middle bearing, like right here, you know, like where it spins, and then sort of angle it up around it. Am I blocking you guys? Can you see? Like that on each side, and then maybe put more spinners around that. Now I could either glue it, or I was thinking of using zip ties to just connect the two. I was also thinking of just using plastic ones, because plastic ones are not that heavy, so as it falls, the metal's gonna fall it's gonna have a much bigger impact when it hits the ground. So that'll definitely shake the egg up. I also wanna put some padding around. So you know the foam padding that comes with some spinners? Here, I actually have a case right here to show you. Some of some spinners come with this foam padding. So I actually wanna take three of these, not the box, just the foam, and layer it around the egg. It technically is, spar is part of a spinner, it's the case. So it actually, this comes with a better one, so I may actually just do that. So that's coming up. I'm looking forward to seeing your comments. Let me know how I could do it, and we're gonna throw it out the same window that all those other ones went out that you just saw today. It should be cool. Maybe we'll have a couple of different designs. We'll do like a whole spinner video, a spinner egg drop. Let me know if that interests you. Coming up, maybe tomorrow or the next day, if you guys saw yesterday's Rainbow Gallium video. I thought it looked super cool. But I melted it, guys. I melted the gallium, and you'd be shocked. I was completely shocked to see what happened. Can't wait to show you the results. That is coming up. And yeah, if you didn't win today's giveaway, don't give up. Brand new video, brand new giveaway tomorrow at, brand new video and giveaway tomorrow at 4 p.m. Eastern time. I will see you tomorrow, guys. Don't forget, stay incredible. Peace.